Hello, welcome back again. And in this video, I will show you how to add video content to your learning module. And there are several different ways you can do that, but we're going to go over three different ways to add video to your learning module. So we are in Chemistry Honors Period 1, which is where we've been working all along. And I'm going to go ahead and open the content window. And when I open the content window, here's that learning module we've been working on. So I'm going to go ahead and open the learning module again, and we're going to build content. And first we're going to add a video by simply adding a video that is already on my computer. So we go to the video, and this video is going to be Chapter 1, Chemistry, The Study of Matter. And so we are going to go ahead and browse my computer because as I said when you're adding a video in this case you're adding a video that is already on your computer so we're going to choose this video here the study of matter and it is an mp4 I saved it I made it on Screencast-O-Matic so it automatically saves it as an mp4 I want it to remain in its original size I want it to auto start when students open it I will also have it loop and we are going to open it right from the beginning so I'm not going to change any of the dates I do however want to track and we are going to go ahead and submit so there we have it um, our first video is on here and it's chapter one chemistry the study of matter uh, the second way we can add a video is we can actually go to creating a web link to a video. So in this case, I'm going to create a web link. And the web link I'm going to change to uh, Grit by Angela Duckworth. And this is a TED. And I'm going to go to that site and I'm going to actually choose the URL and make a copy of it and then bring it back to my content and I'm going to go ahead and add in the URL I can put in a description if I wish but we can do that at another time uh, we could attach a file to it if you wanted to have a question set or if you wanted to have something that the students responded to um, we're going to open it in a new window, yes. Permit users, track, yes. And again, you have the option to open it at a specific date. And we will go ahead and press submit. So now we have added the chemistry video that was already on my computer. We have added the TED video from Angela Duckworth, and that is Grit by Angela Duckworth. And then the third way to add a video is to add what's called a mashup and we can draw from the mashup over here and we're going to choose YouTube and I'm actually going to use that same video but this is the YouTube video and that's Smarter Teacher Chapter 1 Chemistry The Study of Matter and I'm going to go to Go and that's this video right here so I'm going to go ahead and select it And so again, once you choose that mashup, you have the video here. You can add a description. You can add uh, any other information you want. You can tell it to show the YouTube URL. Yes, that's fine. And then you can add a file from your computer if you have a question set or something you want to work with. Or uh, we are going to go ahead and track it again and then submit that. So three ways to add a video. So as I said, you could add it as a video, a file from your computer. You could add it as a web link, or you can add it as one of these mashups from YouTube if you know which YouTube video you are dealing with. Now let's look at what the student will see in each case. So we go to the student preview again, and we go to content. And from content, we'll open up that learning module and here is the flipped lessons from Sophia notice that our hierarchy of 
the learning module is growing and we are going to go down here to chemistry the study of matter and the students will get a quick time video and we will have to download the video or they will go to Angela Duckworth and this they would have to open up here open from Ted and that will take them to Angela Duckworth or if we went to the YouTube mashup they will actually get the video in the window that they are working in so that would give them this video here and it would open up so three ways that you can add video content now I'm going to exit the student preview again we do not want to keep anything we may have done while we are in the student preview and I'm going to go back to content and I'm going to open up that learning module and that video the chemistry the study of matter that is already in my Sophia lesson so I'm going to remove this now so to the right of the title you choose the drop down menu and choose delete and that will delete that lesson now I'm going to use grit later so I'm going to go ahead and leave that one but again the study of matter video is already in my Sophia lesson so I'm going to go ahead and delete that one as well so I choose the drop down menu at the right of the title I choose delete and then select OK and that clears that video and I will use the Angela Duckworth actually in this first chapter uh, in class but it's nice to leave a uh, link so the students can watch it at home or share it later so I'm gonna go ahead and leave that in the learning module and I can adjust it later when I need to so now you have three different ways to add video content.